Hello everyone, welcome back to Let's Play Dragon Age 2. We are going to be doing another one of the main quest line quests today, Act of Mercy. So let's go and uh, check this place out. We actually have to leave the city for this one as well. Oh, wow. This place looks kind of familiar, doesn't it? Oh, time to kill. Man, that was a lot of dragons. Anyway, moving on. See the quest marker up in the corner there. Uh, let me take a look at them. Ah, it's a, it's a ways away. Why are they acting like this is an unexplored portion of the map? Bull crap, I say. Bull crap. Okay, we we actually, I think we have enough money. We only needed, what, 50 sovereigns to buy our way into the expedition? We have 60 now. So we should be able to do it, but I'm not sure that it will let us until we complete the main quest line sections of this game. So we're sort of stuck at the moment. That's why I'm doing this one now. Mistress Hawk. It's him. That Templar from Ariani. I knew this was a bad idea. Ariani tells me you sought a better path than the circle for her son, Fainriel. I thought perhaps you would be willing to show mages a kindness once more. Do I know you? I am Sir Thrask of the Templars. I know from the compassion with which you treated Fainriel that you are someone who cares for the fate of apostate mages. What? You can't be nice yourself? You are no Templar. You cannot know what a badge of shame that would be. There are a number of apostates hiding in those cabins. And you've allowed this? I was hoping you might speak to the group. Convince them to surrender peacefully before my fellow Templars arrive. Who are these apostates? Where did they come from? These are the mages of the former circle at Starkhaven. It burned to the ground, and their Templar sent for us to relocate the survivors. Unfortunately, they escaped on the journey. With their phylacteries burned, it has been nearly impossible to track them. What's a phylactery? When a mage joins the Circle, the first enchanter takes a sample of his blood. It is used as a focus to track the mage should he escape. Do the other Templars intend to do worse than recapture the mages? Sir Caras is a Knight Lieutenant of the Templars, a great crony of Meredith. Should he find apostates hiding from pursuit, Meredith will consider him justified in murdering the lot of them. Who's Meredith? You have clearly not been in Kirkwall long. Meredith is Knight Commander. She has changed the rules for mages in Kirkwall. They are less free than elsewhere. Though I dare say she has created as much dissent as obedience. If you've got this many mages escaping, you Templars aren't too good at your jobs. These mages have shown they attack Templars on sight. You have a better chance than I to convince them they are better off alive in the circle than free and dead. Sir Karas hunts them as well. If they have not surrendered by the time he arrives, this will be a bloodbath. Okay, so that is our quest. We have to go and sort of convince these mages to return to the circle. Now, generally throughout the Dragon Age series... Oh shit, they're gonna fight their way through it. Got the one. Is this blood magic? Only one way out for these mages now. 
the thing about Templars in this game is that they're generally a group of people who see the mages as being a threat or they take everything as the opportunity to bully them around and all that kind of stuff. That isn't, obviously, in a realistic situation, not every single Templar is going to be the exact same way. This one um, has some pity for the mages, and he's trying to convince us to go in there and sort of end this situation peacefully rather than wait for his compatriots to show up and just slaughter everyone. Because there's plenty of um, Templars out there that would just love nothing more than to wander around and start slaughtering mages that get all uppity. Even refers to it as being a shame for himself that he is a Templar and doing these things against the mages and all that. Ah, she can handle that one. It is a bit of an unusual thing, though. We haven't seen that many, too many times um, in, the, in the past. Most Templars have been like, Oh, hell, kill them all, Viana! And this Knight Commander Meredith. Hey, look, this place looks familiar, doesn't it? That Knight Commander Meredith is probably the worst one of them all. We haven't... I think we've actually seen her already, haven't we? I'm not sure if I've seen her in this playthrough or not yet. I think we have. And she's kind of, uh... One of the more ruthless or paranoid... Made, uh, Templars. Like I was saying before, though, in previous episodes... The fear of the mages in s some way in some ways, is actually justified. Stupid camera. Maker's blessing. I thought I was going to die down here in this... This tomb. Are you with the Templars? Please, I need to go back to the Circle. I never wanted to get involved in this. Not when he started making those... those... things. Who is he? Decimus. It was his decision. He kept saying the Templars would label us blood mages if we fled. Why not use it if it's our best tool? He slit his wrist and the magic... It rose from the blood and woke the skeletons in the cave. I ran. Decimus is wrong. Blood magic is a work of evil, not just a power the Templars keep from us for spite. Decimus is the leader of these mages. He's crazy. He said with our is gone, no one could find us. We would be free. I think maybe he set the fire. There must be a demon working through him. No normal man would profane the dead like this. The Templar Thrask is waiting outside. Surrender to him and you won't be hurt. I surrender. Take me to the Templars. I don't want anything to do with this blood magic. The rest of them, they're still following Decimus. He's gone mad. I think he'd kill us all just to take the Templars down. See, there's another example of something you might not expect to see. A mage that is actually willing to accept the sort of... Um, sort of oppression that the Templar has put on them. And you'll see that that's something a little bit more common that you're going to see in this series. I'm pretty sure we had seen it in in uh, Dragon Age Origins. I think Wynn had that kind of uh, that kind of mentality. Hey look, this place looks familiar too, doesn't it? Wynn had that kind of thought and some of the characters in Inquisition are going to have that thought as well. That it is necessary for the mages, in, to some degree, to be held under the boots of the Templars. Because they are a legitimate dangerous thing, so it's, it's complicated. <laughs> now there is our uh, Decimus. There's our, there's our guy we gotta go kill.
they're here. The Templars have come to take us back to the Circle. Decimus, no! Stay your hand. These are no Templars. What do I care what shield they carry? If they challenge us, the dead themselves will meet the call. Ah, here we go. I died. Okay, I'm doing much better this time. I took out Decimus pretty early. Oh, no, oh, Hulk's down, though. Ah, shit. Tell me I'm gonna lose here, too. Oh. Okay. We pretty much just beat him down now. Or not. Hold on, hold on. I'll be okay. I'll be okay. You killed him. Oh, Decimus. You should have listened to me. Oh. You. You are one of us. But you wear no mark of the circle. How is it you side against your own? That man was a blood mage. I don't have to be part of the circle to know that is wrong. Decimus gave us the courage to face the Templars. Without him, we would be prisoners still. The minute he resorted to blood magic, he signed his execution warrant. I warned him. I told him once he marked himself as a blood mage, that was all anyone would see. She won't admit it, but it's obvious she's just as corrupted. I swear to you, I have had no truck with demons. Please. We only want our freedom. Without your help, the Templars will execute us all for Decimus's crimes. If not in the Circle, how do you intend to live? I hear there are places outside the pre-marches where the Templars are not so vigilant. What do you ask of me? There is a Templar who followed us. You must have met him when you entered. Kill him, and we can get clear of Kirkwall before the Templars send more men. I would not see these mages killed. But if we start murdering Templars, we'll draw their fury down on us. They would have us kill a man for doing the just work of a Templar. Will you buy us time to flee Kirkwall? Leave it to me. By the time I'm done, these Templars will swear that the sky is green. Your confidence almost makes me believe you. But I spent two weeks traveling with these Templars. They strike first and think after. They are far easier to kill than to fool. Alright, I'm... Uh, they want me to go and kill that, the Templar. Essentially the only Templar out there that we've seen so far that has had some measure of sympathy for the mages. And that doesn't quite seem like the best idea. I mean, even... Um, I imagine they're... Most of the Templars that are in Sir Ah oh, shit, here we go. So I'm going to try and convince him that they're dead. I... <laughs> Rather than going out there and killing the only Templar out there that might potentially not be the evil one. One of the things 
that I have a problem with this. And then I've never played the console versions of this game, but it's possible that it's not as big of a problem for them. But the the whole um, control scheme, like right now, what I just tried doing, it can be difficult to target enemies on this, especially it seems like the higher resolution you push this game, the smaller the cursor appears on the screen. So it can be hard and harder and harder and harder to control this game in battle. Like I click on this enemy and I'm pretty damn sure I clicked right on the enemy, but apparently I didn't because because Hawk stood there and didn't attack that skeleton that ran past her. And that's why I died a couple of times in that in that other battle was because, like, oh, man, it, it, everything's moving so fast, it's hard to do it. Now you can pause the game. Paused. And issue commands, like you could in Dragon Age Origins. But it's... Uh, I don't like doing that because it slows down the action and it's not quite as fun, but apparently I have to for some of the more intense battles. Are you trying to tell me this boy is all that's left of the apostates? I ran away when they began to use blood magic, sir. They are not in the cavern, Sir Karas. I have thoroughly explored. Who is this? I was helping Sir Thrask. The apostates are all dead. Dead? But I asked. You've always been soft on the robes, Thrask. Makes me wonder if these demon worshippers haven't gotten their fingers into your mind. Men, search the caverns and keep these interlopers under guard until we see what's in there. Tell your men to stand down. Show these fools what happens when you interfere with a Templar's investigation. Ah, shit. It's getting out of hand. Alright, so yeah, I'm gonna have to... <laughs> pause the screen because I tried clicking on an enemy and I didn't get the uh, I didn't actually target anybody okay I'm gonna end up having to kill him anyway jeez this is <laughs> this is terrible no nah, she's already casting firestorm that's what I wanted to do whatever See, it's happening again. I'm trying to click on this enemy and it's not happening. <laughs> there he is. And Hawk just stands there doing nothing. Kinda of screwy, but I got it here. <laughs> uh, 
guy's tough. Okay, I'm gonna have to run away and let that Templar guy deal with this one. Run away! Run away! Run away! Hardly seems like a proper way to have a fight, does it? <laughs> gotta do what you gotta do! Once their stamina regens, I'll be able to hit him again. Uh, I don't know if it's regenerating. Oh, no, nope, he's distracted. And the other Templar is hitting, on, hitting him a little bit. Okay, there we go. By the grace of the Maker, they're dead. I wanted this to end peacefully, not... There can be no peace between the Mages and Templars of Kirkwall, sir. It has gone too far. You did not aid your fellow Templars. Does that mean you're leaving the Order? I suppose my side has been picked. I will tell the other Templars you killed Karas and I came upon the bodies. I will give a false trail to follow. Thank you. And thank you. Please accept this as the only reward I can offer. I dare not carry a staff with the mark of Starkhaven on it now. This has been more than I expected. We must away. As must we. Come, Alan. I'm sorry you were the only one I could save. Well, that got out of hand. <laughs> there are dead bodies all over the damn place. Alright, let's go. Oh, there's another one here. This is really far away from where the battle took place. Did I run this far? Jeez. <laughs> no, no, I can get out this way too. If you're a turn home, you'll be able to um, uh, not have to go and do things like use injury kits to heal your team members, because... Wasn't a letter for... for Hawk? <laughs> it's for Bethany. Whatever. Yep, there we go.